Hello, everyone, welcome back to AppGeeker. Today this video will show you how to unlock your iPhone SE when iPhone unavailable or security lockout appears on your screen. There are many reasons why iPhone unavailable or security lockout may appear on your iPhone SE screen. It could be that you forgot your iPhone passcode or someone else secretly changed your passcode without your knowledge iPhone unavailable or security lockout will appear on your iPhone SE screen after you have tried the wrong password several times. At first, iPhone unavailable or security lockout, try again in one minute will appear. But as you enter the wrong password more often, iPhone unavailable or security lockout will stay on your screen and you are not allowed to continue entering password. Don't worry, you can still unlock your iPhone SE without a passcode. The only way Apple allows to fix this is to reset your iPhone. Resetting your iPhone will remove your passcode. In this way, iPhone unavailable or security lockout will no longer appear on your screen. This video will introduce you four methods to unlock iPhone SE. These methods will help you get rid of iPhone unavailable or security lockout problem. And they are applicable whether you have the iPhone SE first or the second or third generation of the phone SE. So let's get started. The first way to unlock your iPhone SE is to use the erase iPhone option. It is the most convenient way to use erase iPhone to solve the problem of unlocking iPhone SE. Because it doesn't require a computer, just a few taps on your iPhone SE will unlock your iPhone wirelessly. But there are some conditions you need to meet to use this method. First, your iPhone SE should be running iOS 15.2 or later, as well as connected to an internet connection. And you need to clearly remember your Apple ID and passcode. If your iPhone ES meets these conditions, then you can use the Erase iPhone option to unlock your device. After seven consecutive incorrect password attempts, you can see iPhone unavailable or security lockout, try again in 15 minutes on your screen. And there is an erase iPhone option in the bottom right corner of the screen. Tap erase iPhone option and then go to the erase all content and settings page. This page will tell you that all your private data will be deleted. Tap erase iPhone option again and input your Apple ID passcode according to the prompt. When the Apple verification is successful, it will automatically go into the erasing process. After the reset is over, your iPhone SE will reboot with the Hello screen. You can immediately set it up. And if you have a backup, you can choose to restore your lost data from iCloud or computer in the app and data step, then complete the rest of the steps. Once done, your iPhone SE will be unlocked, and iPhone unavailable or security lockout will no longer appear on the screen. But if the Erase iPhone option doesn't work on your iPhone SE, a third-party unlocking service named iPhone Unlocker will probably be the best alternative. Not only does it require no Apple ID and password, but it's easy to use with a few clicks when prompted and doesn't take much of your time. Moreover, iPhone Unlocker has the ability to remove Apple ID and screen time. For this method, you need a computer with iPhone Unlocker downloaded and installed and a USB cable and the steps are as follows. Firstly, open iPhone Unlocker on your computer and click white passcode panel, the blue one. Secondly, connect your iPhone SE to the computer and click start. Then click the device connected but not recognized link in the page and follow the instructions on to put your iPhone SE into the recovery mode. Next, confirm the relevant information of your iPhone and click start to download the firmware for your device. This process will take a while, please wait patiently. After the firmware download is complete, you will see an unlock confirmation page, follow the prompts to enter 0000 and click unlock, the software will automatically help you complete the rest of the unlocking work. During this process, please ensure the iPhone SE that you put into recovery mode is always connected to your computer. When the computer screen shows you have unlocked your device successfully, it means your iPhone SE has been unlocked. You can start to set it up and choose to restore your backups in the process of setting up your iPhone. The third option is to use iTunes to unlock iPhone SE. It is one of the officially recommended methods by Apple. Make sure that your PC is running with Windows 10 or later. 
Besides, this method requires your iPhone SE to enter recovery mode and uses the latest version of iTunes. Step 1. Turn off your iPhone SE. For iPhone SE first, press and hold the top button until the power off slider appears, then drag the slider to the right to turn off your iPhone SE. For iPhone SE second third generation, keep pressing the side button and the volume down button at the same time until you see the power off slider, then drag the slider to the right to turn off your iPhone SE. Step 2. Plug iPhone SE into the computer and put it into the recovery mode. For iPhone SE first, hold the home button until you see the recovery mode. For iPhone SE second third generation, press and hold the side button until a cable pointing to the computer appears on your iPhone screen. Step 3. Restore your iPhone SE. Launch the latest version of iTunes on your computer, if not, you should upgrade it first. When the small box for restore and update options appear, select restore. Choose Restore and Update in the next following pop-up interface. The computer will download and install the latest version of iOS and unlock your iPhone automatically. It is worth noting that the iPhone SE will exit the recovery mode if the restoring time is too long and you need to start from the step 1 to get iPhone SE back into recovery mode. If your iPhone SE is connected to Wi-Fi and Find My has been turned on, you can unlock your iPhone SE with Find My feature. First, go to iCloud.com through the browser and sign in with your Apple ID and passcode. After successfully logging in, click Find iPhone icon, and then click All Devices at the top of the page to select your device. Then select Erase iPhone from the box that pops up in the upper corner. When a prompt appears and asks you if you want to erase this iPhone, click Erase, then enter your passcode again to verify your identity, and the unlock process will begin automatically. After waiting a while for the process to complete, your iPhone will restart, and then follow the prompts to set up your iPhone SE to make it available again. These are the methods to unlock your iPhone to fix the problem of iPhone unavailable or security lockout. Hope this video can help you. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel and learn more about how to unlock iPhone. If you have more questions about iPhone unavailable or unlocking iPhone, please let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching.